Hello all and welcome back once again. Babes and Games here. Bringing you a little bit more Let's Play action so here with the Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. The community is growing at an exponential rate. So sit back, relax and enjoy the ride. And make sure that you don't miss out on this illustrious journey of a popping off YouTuber. We are growing at an immense rate. Things are going really, really well. We're about to hit our first 500 subscribers. So if you're not currently subscribed, make sure that you are. Ring that post notification bell. Give the video a thumbs up if you love it. Thumbs down if you hate it. And comment and let me know what you're thinking. What you've been up to. What's your cat's name? What's your dog's name? I don't care. Just drop a comment for me. I just love comments. No luck at Town Hall, I take it. So we're back in Nibelheim. Gotta get a key card. In current day, no flashbacks right now. He's inspecting the reactor. Morosaki. We always need a ninja. Really? You sure? Positive. <laughs> Ask anyone around here. I'm the best there is. I'm the best right. around. You sure you're gonna be okay? We're going on a hike and getting a key card. How tough can it be? You'll still be gone for a while. Sure there's nothing you need to take care of? I'm putting you in charge of provisions. Then make it snappy. My materia needs me. So, by the sounds of it, it's going to be quite the journey. So, we're going to get stocked up here, guys and girls. Of all boys and girls, guys and girls, men and women. Let's go. He, she, they, them. All that good jazz. Let's, um... Let's just have a... Oh, my God. These guys, man, they scare me to death. Mark this up. Just check. We got plenty of supplies, but I'm pretty sure we do. Um, actually... Oh, shit. All right, we got a... We got a little bit of, uh... A little bit of SP to spend, is it SP? I think it is. Right, punisher mode, counter damage by 10%. Hold the button to gather strength. Until your partner to unleash his chat. Oh my god, that looks awesome. Fire magic without expending. Chain attack. Strength and fire material spells. Definitely. Not only does this allow us to cast spells without using SP. But he's also going to strengthen our fire materia. See what your partners perform a ranged scatter shot attack. Oh. Ice magic. Guaranteed hit. Free. Free as a bird. We take it all day long. I wish we could zoom out a little bit more on this, you know. We'll just take this for now. Synergy damage up. Um, we've also got counter spin potency. Yeah, we'll take that. We'll take that. We'll just have a little look around here. All right. MP by three, maybe. Weapon level. Required weapon level five. Increases magic defense by 35. That's pretty big, right? We take that. That's a pretty big one right there. Um... Okay, Tifa. I get the feeling we've missed a minor node. It's kind of feeling like eventually we just kind of get all these. Um, I'm not sure if there is like a right or wrong way to approach it. I'm sure we'll find out once we hit max level. Faith status. Uh, synergy skills. We'll take that. Eight safe. Uh... Slightly increased MP regeneration speed. You're in battle. What the hell? We can regen MP, can he? Is that right? Alright, we'll take that. MP is so important. Uh, back on cloud. It looks like we're, we're Gucci here. Let's go to the shopkeeper. Here a long time ago, right? That's correct, my We'd love. Appreciate it if you didn't cause us any trouble. Petrification. Both gradual and insustained. We've, we've got those, though. A barrage blaster. 
Oh shit, new weapons. All right, we, 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 we take that. Vavodos, Vavodos bracelet. Grade 11. A stout bracelet that once graced the thew, dewy arm of the Dragon King himself, Abel's pleasure at Nibelheim region. My days, this boosts some stats though, right? Does this, what? I don't understand. So it's saying it puts up defense and magical defense, but uh, it's looking like It's looking like a great magical defense uh, item. Um, so we've got the earrings that bolster survival vest, which gives us vitality by 10%. Interesting. Probably do with a couple of those actually. I don't like that the description so far over on the right hand side it's kind of frustrating it should be closer to what we're actually looking at we'll get these queen's blood booster packs because we are going to be playing it on our second playthrough oh my days look at all these weapons dude and we, 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 we like picked up all these along of our journey and not even paid for them like we're just like thieving this shit revival earring star pendant This Vivado's bracelet. Mmm. So it's giving 59 magic resist. Okay. So 59, 28. So that's an armored one. And that's an MR one. Okay. Let's just have a look. So 59 magic resist. Let's, uh... Actually, let's just check some out here. That's a 28-28. Holy shit, that's quite a lot of... Quite a lot of fucking magic resist, that. Pardon my French. Oh, my God. The snail shell bracelet gives 53-25. Do we do have a 53 already? 53.25. Any more. Remember that, all right? Fine. If you're that desperate to buy. Do we got a 53. 53.25. Let's just have a look. So this is definitely an upgrade. It's not a massive upgrade, though. Um, we haven't got enough to buy three. We'll buy two. You always stick the slightly low ones of the other party members. It's nothing per Nothing personal. Now we didn't actually check. Um so this is a four slot. And this is a five slot. So it is definitely an upgrade. Uh we'll stick this on Earth actually. She probably needs a little bit more protection. -y. Also, we need to look, right? So we got Arcane Ward, Radiant Ward, Lustrous Shield. No, we need to... Oh, shit, though. If we use this... Um, Punches a ward, fills NTB charges with the ward, increased the LZ NTB. Mm. We do kind of need this, but the problem is we are giving up a hell of a lot of um, So it's looking like the weapon upgrade system is just kind of these bottom Wind up damage so I'm just wondering where we get these weapon skill ones from. We don't really have. Let's just put the crit, crit damage, crit. Put these up. Um, increase physical guard. Uh, MP recovery rate up. Slightly increases MP 
Regeneration speed during battle. And punisher mode. I don't know, they do seem pretty good. I think we'll just stick with those for now. Uh, let's go for some crit here. Massive recharge, the amount of energy. I just feel like a bit, a bit crit, a bit crit happy. Sort of. We've got Smackdown, Lifesaver. Oh my god, look at that gun, guys. That looks badass. Temple increase your HP and take damage you take from other party members. Use your HP to heal all eyes. Well, active. Interesting. I mean, we'll try this out, okay? Oh, way up to the different, the different per weapon. Okay, okay, okay. Double tech enhanced. Uh... I mean, 200 HP is no joke, really. You know what? We'll do selfish cover as well. Be interested to try out some of these uh, new abilities and whatnot. Great to be back in Nibelheim. These guys scare the shit out of me. Like. Uh, Let's go, guys. Oh, hang on. We just want to make sure of a few things, actually. Uh, if we... We may get Yuffie in our party here. Uh, in which case... Wind up healing. Let's give her a fire or a revival. Hold on, let's have a look here, actually. Um... So, blind side. And we don't currently have. Um, we'll give her a snail shell bracelet. Um, give her enhanced magic guard. Yeah, that looks pretty good, actually. Uh, should we give her a fire a fire material? Have we got a spare one knocking them out? Or something that we can give her? A lightning one, perhaps? Okay. So we'll just see how this goes for now. Hopefully it won't change our party too much. If it does, we're screwed, but it is what it is. New bridge just went in, you know. Might shave some time off the trip. Shave some time off the trip. Like plan to me. All right, react. Rufus and Heydigger, sir. Heydigger, however it's said. Nibelheim survey team. It appears they were ambushed by Wu Tai. By Wu Tai. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed, and so it begins. Such a classic villain, right? Look at his lips there, kinky. Right, part. Whoa, 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 sweet child of mine. Party locked. See, oh, this is what I'm worried about. So who's in our party? We got Cloud T for you, fair. Right. Okay, so. We're doing Star Shower. Right, so let's go. So we got Cloud. Cloud's pretty much good to go. Um, we may just give him another HP up or something. Just make sure he's nice and healthy and MP up. Make sure we got plenty. Um, HP up, healing, lightning, fire. Uh, we're going to need a revival on this little chickalita or a prayer. Yuffie, we've got access. 
Revival, Wind, MP up, Healing, Lightning. Have we got a Revival? Got no Prayer on her though. Um... No, let's just check. So we got Chocobo, Leviathan, Alexander. I do not want the Chocobo one, guys. It's, it's just shit. Take E for it. E for it. E for it. E for it. All right, let's go, guy. Oh, I up. Oh, one minute. We've got Focus Throws, Firebolt, Blade, Disorder, Prime Mode, Infinity End. Now, as you can see, they all affect statistically uh, weaponry. Now, Magic Attack Strike with Strong Attack, Switching Mode, Delivers Data. So, do we want Rune Blade? I don't know, I'm kind of feeling uh, the Buster Sword's pretty well-rounded, actually. Actually, though. You know what? Let's do it. Let's go, guys. To battle. Bam, 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 we're going to push forward here. But yeah, the channel's doing really well. It's put me in a great mood today. Nearly at 500 subscribers. Nearly able to monetize the channel. And start doing bigger... Oh, shit. That... What's this? And start doing bigger and better things. And uh, building the community. So I cannot wait. Obviously, any money I do make from the channel... Which I don't think could be a great deal anyway. We'll all be getting put back into uh, Crystal Gloves. Oh my god. We'll all be put back into making the channel a bigger and better experience for the viewer. Because that's what I believe in. Uh, let's have a look. Unfettered. Oh my god. I mean, look at the weapons. They're so well designed, dude. Oh my god. Hazer, Overpower, Star Shower. So we are getting a lot of stuff here with extra magic damage. L3. Oh, we can look at crit rate and stuff. Oh, hey, up. Uh, so for now, I'm not sure whether the magic damage is kind of pointing us towards, you know, magic damage on the weapon rate being the... This is locked off, right? Murasaki's ID card. All right, looks like we're going this way. So I've had a wonderful time with this game. I'm also covering... Um, I've just started playing Warframe. It's been a massive, massive uh, community drive. Um, and great, great response from those videos. Uh, I, I suggest you check them out if you're a Warframe fan. I'm also doing some more Helldiver stuff in Diablo. We've got a lot going on at the moment. So make sure you subscribe so you never miss out on any future uploads. And the community is growing at a great pace. And I'm very happy with how things are going. He's in hands so, a little bit of flashback action there, which we played through earlier on. What is it? Check out the playlist if you missed that episode. It's all coming back to me now. He fell, got swept away by the current. I think he's dead. You never forgot, did you? That's why you've been acting weird. Didn't want to upset you. That's all. Zach's still alive, brother. Don't worry. Zack was my friend. 
How can I just forget him like that? Degradation. It's hollowing me out, bit by bit. You're wrong. You remembered, Cloud. It'll be okay. It will. I know it. Thanks. Thanks, Tifa. You gotta tell Aerith about this. She deserves to know what happened. Yeah. Yeah, she does. But let me be the one to do it. Why? Because she and I are close, you know? Yeah, I love how the relationships have been forming as yep. the game's progressed. Right Very organic, great storytelling. Let's just keep this between the two of us. Promise? Okie dokie. So we have got some more level up machines and whatnot here. So I don't understand why it said, oh, I hope you're ready. And then there's a bloody bench here. Like, what's all that about? Let's go. I wonder if there'll be a mod when it comes out on PC. For, uh, the fight music. Freeze. Sucks to be you. Great stuff. Let's go. So all we need to check from from here is if there's any ether. Always need ether, uh, and we could check. Have a quick check of the materia. Warding grants resistance to link materia detrimental status. Well, that's pretty interesting. Allows you to use physical and magical defense to reduce your spells. Disempowerment. A lot of these materia, we really do need to learn how to use to the full effectiveness. Uh, let's have a look at these. Power risk guards. So the power risk guards do seem... To bolster the problem is when it's showing arrows up it's not always uh such a massive yeah i do kind of feel that the accessories aren't great in this game obviously apart from the ones that stop petrify uh instant death and stuff like that are very very useful but the other ones they don't tend to have many sort of high-end stats on them oh my god look at this we're back boys <coughs> It's all the macho. Oh shit. Let's do our star shower. Oh my god, that's so sick! Star shower's the one. He is the one trinity. That was sick. Let's go. Keep moving forward. These graphics, man. This beautiful, uh... Moonstone, eh? Beautiful, uh... Attention to detail in all these areas. Um... Where, where am I actually going here? Thought we can't actually get through this part. Hold up. Even the little rocking of the rocks and the crystals there on the floor. Even my teammates can knock them over. That's pretty cool. Keep going. Oh, there's a materia here. Oh, let me get the materia. Oh. That's no good. A Marco Spring. A Marco Spring. Zephyr! So, this 
whole thing is materia? I can't believe we got through wow, this much of the game without actually so seeing him or talking to him or fighting him yet. Really are building this up, aren't they? Naturally formed materia. Indeed. And look at the size of it. Astounding. For the Mako energy to condense into something like this, it must have taken an eternity. Hey, we should get out of here. All this Mako's making me queasy. Yeah, me too. Obviously, Cloud's going to be a lot more used to all this Mako. Oh, let's see what this is. The little movements are a little bit difficult in this game. Orb of HP MP material. Oh, what the fuck? What's this do? HP up MP up. Oh, hey, what's this do? So, what's your max HP and MP values? What? So, that can literally give me more. Why would you want to do that? So what happens if I equip this? Hold on. So now I have 62 health. 4,000 MP. That's just stupid. That's insane. Crazy man. Look at my health now. I've just lost all my health. You're not even giving my health back. Oh my god. Actually mental. It's a bit of a noob trap there we got caught in, I think. It's a trap. Piece of cake. Deal with that. Absolutely loving the star shower ability. Which was a classic from the first game, the remake. Boom, 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 boom. Oh my god, it's such a good ability. But we keep moving forward here. Such a beautiful environment. Very true to the original OG Final Fantasy on PS1. I just wish they used a better downscaling filter. But I do feel that when this game comes out on PC, it's going to be absolutely mind blowing. So we're going to use triple slash. Hit all three. AoE attacks. Optimizing now. Really, I'm starting to feel powerful. I just hope the level cap goes above 50. Because uh, we're nearly there. Uh, it was kind of a little bit wounding in the remake once we hit 50. Are you sure we're going the right Especially way? considering on hard mode, there. Uh, being level once 50 in remake made no difference. It just made, like, the game was just severely difficult. Which is great. Uh, Come on. Let's find another route. No need to worry. 
I've already found one. Let's go, you. Whoa, 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 whoa. More climbing, but hey. So good. It's cool that they have these little uh, little tidbits that different characters can do to help out, like Barrett smashing stuff up and shooting crystals and Yuffie throwing a rope about. Oh, let's go. Going to Punisher mode here. And Punisher mode now, a lot more accessible than it's ever been. In Remake, it wasn't amazingly good. Um, let's just assess this here. No, right. so it's weak to wind. Right, okay, okay, okay. So we're going to use uh, wind current. The storm is coming. Oh my god. Gonna go into punishing mode there. As much damage as possible. We're also gonna do Yura on Cloud. We're also gonna switch to Z Pop. And we're gonna do our Star Shower. Boom, 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 boom. Big damage. So we are going to have to do Windstorm. And. Wind Current. Really exploit the weaknesses here. Uh, we're obviously going to heal up Tifa too. Oh my god, it knocks us out of it. I do feel that you can get knocked out of some spells way too goddamn easy. We have to put an ether on cloud already. So let's uh, use Yuffie's heal. So obviously, the more you level up these materials, the bigger the heal is, but MP is uh, a struggling factor. And I do think moving forward, we're going to have to start utilizing. Uh, MP up more than HP up. Take the lead. It is starting to feel a little bit like MP up. Oh, what the hell? We're bugged out. Why can't we hit it? Oh, that's so stupid. It's looking like you's going to be. Uh, oh, this is so dumb. We can throw a boomerang off here. And then, uh, oh, let's have a look. Windstorm it. Wind current. All oh, right, we one bombed it. Pretty good. <coughs> Excuse me. Bit of a frog in my throat there. Need a bit of dispel to get rid of it. Let's go. Uh, we activate this. Not actually entirely sure where we're supposed to be going here. Is this not just going back on ourselves? Yeah, this is going back on ourselves. So I'm just wondering, how do we get past this part?
Did we miss something? All uh, oh, right, you have this big hell that was right in front of us. <laughs> oh dear, my bad. Go, oh, baby. So these ones you have to do perfect block against. It's a bit like parry. So in Punisher mode, when you block, you do like a Counter-Strike thing. With me. Gotcha. There we go. Punisher mode, really good in this game. Let's do a bit of Star Shower. Bada bing, bada boom. Beautiful, baby. Beautiful. Mega potion. Looks like there's a new weapon here for one of us. You know, I can't say I've ever taken this route before. You gonna be okay, Yuffie? Oh, yeah. No problem. <laughs> This is nothing compared to what we got in Wutai. Like the massive sculpture of the Chow carved into the face of this one cliff. The massive sculpture of the Chow. Oh my god, ingenious saber. We got it for Cloud. Let's go. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, look at this. That just looks phenomenal. And the damage increase. Holy shit, guys. From 58 to 116. With only losing a small amount of magic damage. That, my friends, is awesome. And we got an extra materia slot. So, like I said, MP up. Do a bolster our MP here for battle. Which was? So we are Did currently sa the chow beans. So we're at 76 MP now. It's not a massive increase, but uh Tell you what, it's good enough. That's kind, but you really don't have to. Oh well the gimmick is with these the chow beans. <laughs> You're so obsessed with them. Kind of a crazy climb. box here let's go beautiful shadowing on the rocks there it's quite a big box this maybe there's something decent here a pair of fortification materia earrings oh are these ones we could put our own materia into Cooperate all the fortification material. Those use the highest skill fortification material allowing spells protect and shield. Protect and shell. Nice. Do we equip them and get a free material slot for our protection basically? That's pretty cool. Keep going here. A lot of climbing. 
We're nearly at the chippity top though. There was another little loop around bit here. Are we missing out on some stuff if we, if we ignore it? Look at all the material in this sword, it's crazy. Sparkling. Oh yeah, baby. Orb of Warden. See, it pays to have a root. Have a rumble, have a root. With the length and integrity of the story, this is definitely lived up to the legacy. That is Final Fantasy. This is only part two as well, guys. Don't forget, we got another, we got another part incoming at some point in the future. So we are going to have to assess this bad boy. He's uh, not taking a lot of damage. Right, inflation of damage will cause raw become pressured afterwards. It's weak to ice. So we're going to start rolling out nice and easy with the ice abilities. So we've got a snow flurry. We've got icy impulse. And we've got... Uh, let's have a look. Do we have... Um, oh... Buff uh, the enemy with blows, so shouldn't try to heal. So, we're gonna have to rely on these, uh... Right, let's get cheaper in here. We are pressuring it nice, but uh, it's just taking a little bit too long to be fair. We are taking a shitload of damage on you for though. Holy moly. See that damage? I won't give up. Feeling good. This guy's like a bit of a mini boss at himself, I think. Oh shit. Um, let's do a regen on Cloud here. Let's get a big, uh, a big blizzard, blizzard spell here. Oh my god. We're actually in... We're in trouble there, actually. Right, we're going to have to use prayer. Stay strong. And we're going to have to build up again. I'm going to have to get a second prey off here. Oh, my God. Going to punish your mode. My god, this thing's pretty hard to kill, actually. We're gonna do another prey here. We're also gonna use UV's limit break. Wu Tai forever! Yeah! Let's do this. Hopefully we're gonna get clouds. Right. Tifa. Uh let's have a look here. You know what? Let's try Star Show and just see how it does. We are gonna have to heal up Tifa actually before we cast anything. Tifa's in real shit here. Oh, she's fucking dead. 
Oh my god. No sleeping on the job. Now you're in for it. Don't let me down. Deal with that. Okay. Right, let's do cheapest limit break here. Let's finish this. Boom. Get another uh, limit break here. This has been quite a difficult little... Uh, this has to be like a boss, right? Like, I don't think that that's just a normal... Uh, a normal monster, right? Okay, so, right. That was quite interesting. Um, was not expecting that fight to be so difficult, if I'm brutally honest. Um, that was pretty insane. But, nevertheless, we did... We did triumph. And we are a level higher than is required for this zone, so... I was kind of nutty, actually. But we will push forward here. Wow. I've been thinking. We're looking for a guy named Murasaki, right? What about him? It's just, uh, his name sounds Utai. I'm sure plenty of your people immigrated to Midgar before the war. Some of their kids and grandkids probably work for Shinra. Oh. See if there's any secrets knocking around here. I never thought about that before. Yeah. Yeah. It's always good just to have a little look on ledges and whatnot. Well, it seems to be something on top of there. Way to get down. Oh shit. Whee! Let's go. So I wonder if you've got different ways whether there's a secret weapon here. I bet, I bet there's a combination of tunnels you've got to take and one of them's got a secret in it. Like, oh my god, so much going on in this game. It's crazy, right? Don't overdo it. I got this. Right, let's use a uh, star shower. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, big yeah, pressure, yeah, baby. Good to go. Take it over. The one of the good things you can do with Yuffie is you can throw out her weapon with triangle, leave it ticking on the target, go to another, cast, go back to Yuffie, and then cash it in as a big nuke. Because the longer it's spinning on the target, uh, the more her square ability does afterwards. So... So we got a high ether there. So it is great to um use a normal cure here. Uh so it is a great thing to sort of throw out um a shuriken, leave it ticking, depending on what mode you're in out of war, brumal stance, or the other ones, and then stay do to do a quick rotation, like build two bars. Cast something on cloud, and then um, what is going on with this? And then once you've done that, switch back to her, move in, and make sure that you collect the shuriken and do a nice big nuke. Why am I moving this, by the way? Does anybody actually know? Is it so we can climb over this? Just another secret. Oh, yeah, baby. Come on, girls, let's go. Make sure we're not missing anything in here, actually. Oh, shit, I don't think we can get back over now. Oh, well. Such is life. We move forward. When I think about where we've traveled on this entire Let's Play series and the breadth and width of everything that's available in this game, it's kind of mind-blowing. 
I think this is definitely a contender. So we throw out the boomerang, shuriken. So I definitely think this is a contender for game of the year, in my eyes. Holy shit. So there we go, we cashed in there big time. So UV is just a ticking time bomb once we get that over. Um, but yeah, the, the length and breadth of everything that's been going on in this game is just is mind blowing. Apart from the obvious graphical problems, a few issues with the camera and the lock on, they're literally three things that are a major issue. The other issue is like remove mini games from anything core component wise and just have them as a nice to have, not a need to have. And you've got the makings of a perfect game. But the upscaling filter needs to be DLSS or FSR or XESS by Intel. Um, the camera occluding on walls and getting caught. The real pain in the ass. You know, there's a few little niggles with the game. But I think overall it is a fantastic title. And well worth picking up. I don't even understand what's going on here. So we've come down here. We've opened the door. We come through. Ah, right, right, right. I see where we, what we've got done. So we need to keep moving forward this way. Well, no, this is where we came from. Oh, right. Oh. Uh. I'm a little bit confused right now. Oh, we restored power to the facility? Ah, okay. Well, that was a bit weird, right? Strange path indeed. So, I really hope that we get quite a lot of likes and comments on this video because I've got to be brutally honest. My Diablo, my Hell Divers, and my Warframe content at the moment is superseding the Final Fantasy Let's Play in such a massive way that it is, I'm finding it very hard currently to uh, make time for this game. It's not that I don't enjoy the game, I do, but from a content perspective, there are other games that are eclipsing it in such a major way. And I'm talking, some of these episodes have only got 30 views versus 3,000 on a Warframe Let's Play video. Um, so we really need to bolster the support on the series. If you are enjoying it, please let me know. Drop some comments and whatnot. I help the algorithm pump up my videos because, to be brutally honest, there are too many Let's Play channels on YouTube and far too many covering this game. And it's just making life an absolute misery for little YouTubers like myself. But I don't like leaving stuff half done. So we will ensue to finish off the series. But daily uploads may not be the, the way forward. We will see. I'll keep an eye on the analytics. But if you do enjoy the series, show your support by watching every single one. Dropping a comment, hitting the thumbs up and all that good jazz. Uh, and getting it noticed by the analytics. That's all I can ask you to do. And I hope that you do do that. I hate asking for support on videos. Um, and I don't do this just for the popularity of it. But you've got to imagine that putting a couple of hours a day into an episode of Final Fantasy just to have nobody watch it can be uh, a little bit... a little bit heartbreaking. So we got another one of these bad boys. Uh, cloud. Get. Didn't mean to jump in there. Um. So yeah, I don't. I don't like asking for people to subscribe and stuff like that. I mean, it's all part of the game on YouTube. But obviously, it makes more sense to make content that people are actually watching. If that makes sense. Like, like, I'm not in it just for the views. But when you're only getting, say, I think one of the episodes only had seven views, I was kind of thinking, you know what, this is kind of insane. Like, 
Is it really worth my time? Like, I'm going to be playing the game regardless, though, so it's a bit of a catch-22. It's not like I'm only playing the game for YouTube. That's not the case. Like, I love I love Final Fantasy anyway. And I know you do get people... Oh, shit. That only play a game just for views or whatever. I mean, I'm not about that life. But the thing is, I can play this game at my own pace. Uh, perhaps live stream it or look at other avenues of content that are going to bolster my viewership and my growth on the platform. And that's all. Just, just spitballing. I'm not going to hold it hostage. I've started, so I shall finish. But I'm just saying the frequency of the uploads, it may get a bit staggered over the next month or two. We're going to use our... Uh, you're uh, on you, Fi. Oh shit! Oh my god! Right, leave our shuriken on him. On him. So we are in a bit of trouble here. Actually, we're gonna giga potion, you fair. We're gonna elixir. Uh, what? What? Revival earrings broke. The teeth is in a bit of a shit state here. We'll use this on her. Uh, we're going to limit break bloodbath on the dragon. Let's go, baby. Bang, 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 bang. I got this. So, arrow. Into punisher mode. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's finish this off. There we go, beautiful. These dragons are so hard to beat. Like, it's actually crazy. Um, Was it this way? We're going into the cave think so but yeah that bit of a rant there i mean i don't know it's gonna get taken badly probably i mean it's a hot take but you got to understand the perspective on where i'm coming from with a youtube channel when you've got six or seven channels that are like multiple million views per episode and i can't even push seven on some of these some of these uh, episodes a little bit disheartening and it's uh it's a lot of time and work that i do put into these videos so if you do enjoy them all i'm asking is show that support it doesn't cost anything thumbs up drop a comment say something nice about the series <laughs> make me feel better and uh that's all i'm asking you to do guys and that'll make my day so we'll move forward from that and uh yeah it was just something that was on my mind it's kind of crazy how how little uh, how little viewership we're actually getting on such a massive title as well. Let's just have a look here. So I am very confused on where we are actually supposed to be going here. I will say that's another little pet peeve. You can get lost on this game so goddamn easy. Granted, I do not have the best sense of direction to begin with. <clears throat> I'm just wondering, are we supposed to take this lift back down? Were we even supposed to come back up? Like, we restored power here? But it's very confusing on where we're actually supposed to be going. We're just gonna have a quick look round here. I'm going to guess we kind of missed out on something. 
It's looking like this is the way to go. So we did restore power earlier. So moving back in here, it does look like this is the way we were supposed to go initially. Uh, we did have to double back though to get the power back on, which was a bit... It threw me a little bit, actually. We did get another Mega Potion there. So I'm a bit concerned that we're going to be fighting like a super big dragon in this episode. Which could be problematic considering the smaller ones have been so difficult. <laughs> I do like you people. My God, she can talk. So, it's that time again, sadly. We are fast approaching. Well, we have surpassed the one-hour mark here. But we will progress forward to sort of this little check mark. Check point up ahead. From Wutai. From Wutai. Which means we're at war? You were always at war, Yuffie. But what about my mission? command call it off why didn't anyone tell me aren't we in the middle of a ceasefire though that's what they say still doesn't mean we are and it makes no difference to them either way come on we gotta find Murasaki Gotta find Murasaki. Right. That's right. Stay positive, Yuffie. It's all good. This is it. There's no turning back. So there you go. We're at the end of another illustrious banger no of an episode an of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. And what I said earlier about the viewership and whatnot, it doesn't mean this game is any less or more important to me. I am going to be playing this game regardless, but I would just love to see a little bit more support from you guys in the form of likes and comments. Let's get it moved up the algorithm. I just make my time a little bit more worthwhile because it does mean a lot to me and playing this game has been such a great experience and a great learning curve and done so much for me uh learning my youtube and whatnot that i just kind of feel that it's my baby and i just like to just see it get a little bit more love but with all that out of the way we're fast approaching 500 subscribers and we'd love to have you here on the channel so if you have enjoyed this style of content please consider subscribing and I'll see you guys in the next episode.